Nautic Ed, the world's most advanced online sailing education. We're here at Antigua Sailing Week talking to Frank Agavino. Frank, what brought you to Antigua? Well, I've, I've uh, used uh, Nordic Ed several times and uh, on their email list and they uh, received an email from them about the possibility of uh, learning a lot more about sailing and a sailing experience with uh, one of their partners, Safe Passage Sailing, and it sounded like a great opportunity and uh, they went ahead and uh, signed up for it. I've learned so much about sailing, probably more in this week than uh, I've learned in the in the many years that I've uh, been sailing. It's it's just been a great uh, great experience. I've used Nautic Ed uh, many different times just to keep track of, uh, of things that I need to be aware of before I go out sailing, and also just to uh, to refresh my uh, my knowledge of sailing. And it also provides a little bit of confidence as I. I click through all the different courses they have, I get a better understanding of, of uh, what I need to be doing and uh, are good reminders. Round the world sailor Brian Thompson is skippering one of the four identical FAR 65 charter boats here, a long way from his record-breaking exploits. Three, two, one, checking. Now this uh, charter pay and play philosophy is absolutely brilliant. It gets people out sailing and uh, you know they might have a boat in the UK or uh, USA and they can just come down and do, do the regatta here without having to take the boat all the way out here. Or individuals can, can experience not just coming here and going cruising but coming here and uh, doing something uh, really fun like race week. On the track in perfect conditions, racing was as good as it gets. Enjoyed Nordic Ed and also playing with some of the tools that they have online. The, uh, the sail trim tool is, uh, is great fun and uh, it always, uh, always beats me, but uh, <laughs> it's fun to see how to set those sails. And the crew are working fantastically for people, some people who've never uh, raced before, before yesterday. It's a lot of fun to uh, get everyone working together. And what was it like racing with Brian Thompson? Well, Brian Thompson's amazing. He's uh, first of all, he's a he's a wonderful teacher. He's uh, he's uh, very uh, humble and and calm, and he gives great explanations. Uh, and Brian has amazing experience, his, his many round the world trips, and uh, and all his world records, and his sailing with Steve Fawcett. Uh, just uh, it was uh, it was a great surprise to be able to find out that I could sail with him and uh, just enjoy working with him and uh, he's just even wonderful just to chat with. Two of Brian's crew have come from the cold climbs of Canada. We're down here mainly because we are um, relatively new at sailing and uh, heard about the opportunity to come and crew on a boat that we've watched uh, many times this type of racing on television and thought it would be a great experience to come and give it a try. There was snow coming down on the front yard and we said, okay, let's go sailing. Well, I'm a beginner sailor and um, it, it is ten times more intense than I ever dreamed that it would be. Keep going, get down next. Keep going, down next. You know, even at the basic level of, of sailing, which is what I have, I, you know, I feel like I'm contributing, that I'm part of the team. Overall, it's been fantastic. I would highly recommend it. When I first got here I was probably understanding about 50 to 60 percent of all the different things that were being explained and uh, today I can say that uh, probably 95 to 100 percent of what's going on in a rather complicated racing boat is, uh, is clear to me and uh, just a uh, uh, wonderful uh, learning experience. Three, two, one. What are your thoughts on participating in other regattas? Or? Oh, definitely. I think uh, this this type of uh, this type of experience where you can uh, just uh, 
go out and train for a few days and then uh, and learn uh, different positions on the boat and then to go out and, and race and actually uh, use those use all the knowledge that you've learned in particular uh, positions on the boat and then rotating in the course of the week it's, uh, it's just uh, amazing. The cruising classes finished in Jolly Harbour for a barbecue on the beach and why not? And now whose round is it? Cheers! <laughs>